Oh, it must be rocks, I guess. So... We have to figure out how to get up there. Oh, ladder. I thought they might have been bodies. Climb, please, climb. There we go. Yeah, I guess I've seen too many horror stories, I guess. Okay, Charlie, don't freaking fall, okay? Craven's coming out the window. So what is the point of this? Oh, geez, we can actually get in here? Why are we in here? For clues! Okay, I don't have the business card anymore, do I? Oh, I do, I do, okay. Get in there. Black Omen, how are you doing? Doing pretty darn good. Another clue. Morbid curiosity, I guess. No. Oh my goodness, I didn't read it. Come on. Grab it. Patient, Monday, Hector. I saw Hector, seven-year-old male in my office today. He was accompanied by his mother, who informed me that Hector is complaining of feeling sick and tired. Hector appears to be mildly unnourished, underweight. Mother also prescribed two milligrams of diazepam. Hector, recent hospital mission for acute bronchitis. Hector has collapsed during school lessons. Hector is recovering well from the virus in two weeks since hospital admission which was likely caused by mixing with other children at school while the immune system was weakened. So we have a child with some issues. Maybe with a mother with a hypochondriac kind of syndrome. Perhaps. Is that it? Nope. Next game right here, folks. Next game. That's a little teaser for the next game, I'm guessing. Yeah, Black Omen, you were gifted a sub by Baked Potato there uh, not that long ago, yeah. Exactly. Uh, all right. Well, I don't know what other purpose of this was other than see the childhood medical records. Time to shimmy. No, that's not shimmying. Yeah, I'm guess I'm just guessing, Kim, because that doesn't look like any of the other games we've seen, right? But I could be wrong. Like maybe that was an Easter egg, maybe. Right now there's four. This is the fourth, but they ha are working on the fifth game. Push. Okay, Mark, you've been mostly useless, to be honest. Now, where are we pushing this thing? I think we want to go on the roof. Climb? No, I don't think I want to climb. Uh, you think Little Hope graphics were the best? I mean, I'll be honest with you. Little Hope was definitely a one that I will remember. I think it was very well done. 
I think each of them has their own charm. Um, but that, that one was kind of just creepy because of the whole, like, witch trials and, like, doppelgangers and such, you know? I don't know, Mark's just kind of, you know, not trying to break a sweat, I guess. Oh, cool. There's a dog out here. Yeah, I did too. Yeah. Scared the shit out of me. You scared him off, but panicking most likely. What is this? Is this like a morgue? Uh, that looks very ugly. Somebody went through the meat grinder, maybe? How's your head to victim discovered with head switched? Nice. The heads were switched. Yeah, that was a little gruesome, wasn't it? Crawl into something that can be locked from the outside. For me, it's House of Ashes, Devil and Me, Little Hope, and then Man, uh, Man of Medin. That's your order? Yeah, yeah. It's a good one. Where's your head at? Where's your head at? <laughs> Time to hold your breath. Well, I guess Charlie's not the bad guy, right? Fuck. Gee, where could the person be? There's like only hiding spots that fit a human that are in this room. I smell the fear. Hold your breath. Yeah, at least you don't have to hold your controller still. Yeah, what was that? Is that the quarry you had to do that? That was crazy. It was super sensitive, too. No, it wasn't the quarry. What was it? That was until dawn, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 until dawn. You like the uh, Little Hope la last? I mean, that's the beauty of it, right? Like, there's so many. You can pick and choose what you enjoy. It's all good. Okay. Cameras to the garden. Hmm. Oh my god. What? What is he doing? He's preserving his kills. He's preserving his kills? Why? Because they're valuable to him. The trophies. Sex. That's perfectly normal. Dimash sure seems to know a lot. Do you think maybe we're dealing with more than one person? What do you mean? Tending this place, the weird robots, the traps. Could it be just one man? It's one man. One very driven, very disturbed man. I think I need to go up there. Okay, let's see what else is in here. Uh, oh 
Okay. Oh, look, somebody's on ice. Oh, bloody hell. Who's that guy? He's on ice. He's an icicle. Beautiful. Fixation, dissection, removal of body fat and water, impregnation, positioning, and curing. All the instructions we need. Step by step. Good progress. Signs of rigidity in the extremities. Previous subject, Mr. Lewis Harrison required disposal in acid bath. Continued pos positive progress. Extremities fully hardening. Limbs 50% harder. So this guy has been busy. Very busy. Oh, yeah. Science. Right? Blinded me with science. Mark, anything else? My dude? My bro? We're we gonna go upstairs now. Let's go upstairs. Like we glitched through the wall there a bit. Oh, cool, more bodies. Holy cow. Um, so, you think there's anyone in one of these things that's maybe a little alive, maybe? I don't think I wanna go down there just yet. Oh, damn. This guy's been busy. Oh, that freaked me out. That's fine, right? You think they're all very dead? Okay. I'm sure it's fine. Whose clothing? Oh, it's a freaking coin. <laughs> oh, no, it's a wedding ring. Oh, that's the other wedding ring, then. Your partner ring or whatever. Friendship ring. Yeah, there's definitely one of these is going to be alive. I think we just gotta run through and get it over with. I'm sure it smells lovely in here. Uh, I don't wanna go down the creepy hole on the floor. Can I crawl across? Yes, I can, phew. Get to push this down, maybe? Yes, we do. Okay, we're pushing it. Shrink wrap like a supermarket. Yeah. Okay. Hope this holds. Way to go, Mark. Thanks for everything. Wait, Kate's still alive, right? Because Aaron's dead. Jamie's dead. No, wait. Uh, oh, I guess we're going this way. This looks super sturdy. It's totally fine. Not Jamie Frazier! Uh, uh, 
Oh, cool. Thanks, Mark. You just made it like twice as hard as it needs to be. Way to go, bro. Look how long this is. Are you kidding me? Early. Wow. <laughs> oh, frickin' Mark. No one's getting out of this thing alive, I guess. One less passenger. Well, actually, Charlie was driving the bus. I did not let him die. It was a balancing mini game. And clearly, I don't know how to balance. All right, Kate. You're kind of the worst, but whatever. My mustard. Sweater lady, I will shed a tear for you. Gibbs always kills everyone? Oh my goodness. You make it sound like I'm doing this on purpose. You guys are just so mean. She's Mary suing it? I guess. Uh. Run! Go for a jog! It's over this way. We have a piece of fabric? I'm not sure what the point of that is. Let's finish what you started. No one survives. That's not what I started. I didn't start with like... Okay, so how do I get everyone dead? This case should have been dead. I panicked and I accidentally killed Aaron. Okay, that was totally on me. I picked up versus down and I killed Jamie. And I didn't balance on the beam and killed Charlie. Kate has plot armor. Yeah, I guess so. Why are we going back into another house? Like, ay ay ay. I would take my chances swimming. Hmm. Oh, cool, we've got dogs in there. <laughs> Thanks, cat. That sounds like a very hungry dog. Or injured, right? Oh, damn. Why are we doing this with the dog? No dog arm? Oh, he's got his beautiful axe. Super sharp. Easy boy. Easy boy. <laughs> Gibbs has a death note. Wow.
Keep the dog quiet. Is she gonna cut the dog? I'm not sure who the dog belongs to. Good question. Good point. Seriously, we're gonna stab the dog? Are you crazy? That's insane. Why would you stab the dog? Oh well, I guess Kate's dead. <laughs> I'm not gonna stab a dog! No! Oh. What the hell? That was a dirty little trick. <laughs> that was a dirty little trick. We all thought the same thing, chat. We all thought the same horrifying thing. Kate was gonna... Oh, no. Kate was gonna shiv the dog. I still have nightmares about Until Dawn and how I ended that playthrough. Uh, spoiler alert, I killed everybody in the last second of the game. With that stupid bomb. All buildings are bad. Trust no buildings. Let's get that light on. Okay, get the light on. All right, Marky boy. Oh, I thought that was an arm. Hey ho ho, lizard. Lizard. I played that game. I had attachments to some of those characters and I felt really bad for a minute or two. Are we back to the shower room? Mark, you've been here before, boy. Did you enjoy the shower the first time and you need another... Do you not have anything? Okay, you got a red light. Oh no, maybe it's just an old building. No, we definitely were here, or one of the characters was here. He's an artist! So this two mech guys had like at least four or five of these cards with different uh, job titles underneath it. So that's kind of neat. Clearly being impersonating a bunch of different people. Evidence. At 0600 hours, I, Officer Frank Hooper, discovered that one or multiple individuals had gained unauthorized access to the evidence room at 1612 West State Street. <laughs> Among the missing items were assets recovered from the apartment of former FBI agent Hector Monday, including books, clothes, notes, surgical tools, and dental equipment. We are currently running with the theory that this was the direct result of souvenir hunters looking for a piece of memorabilia from the case. End of report. Basic Canva business card? Maybe it's not basic, it could be based. You know what I mean? The simplicity of it all is just like pure art. Uh, okay, that's... Whoa, whoa, Mark. Marky, Mark. Go this way, please. More tape recorders. Mr. Kumar, I want my team dead. I'll get them to you this weekend. Just do it. 
I guess this was what Aaron was talking about. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. Dumet. I want my team that we did. I'll get them then. She was faked. Let's do it. Fake uh, fake news. Fake. This is a clever edit. That's not how Charlie speaks. Poor Aaron. She died thinking Charlie set us up. Comic Sans business card? Wait, that's a bad thing? Okay, rifle through. Hector Waylon London. Wait, what, what? Oh, it's a degree. Science and medicine? He had a degree in psychology. Holy crap. Um, I guess I should have been paying attention to this stuff. We got all sorts of goodies in here. Uh, huh. Cool. Not a very big fan of Charlie from the looks of it. Mm -mm. Design is my passion. Bring out the Comic Sans. Yeah, poor Charlie. He can't balance on the balance beam. He was never really good at gym, was he? So we have a key, another key. It's a boat key, I think. That's right, because it's got a little floaty thing on it. Looks like there may be another boat on the island. Think of all the dust in here for you folks that have got allergies. Maybe some bed bugs? I don't know. Won wonky controls, I guess. This alone, my parents are helping out, but they're both very old now. Come home, Clarence, please. El Mundi. I thought I should write you with the news as you haven't been to see me in six months. You have a son. I gave birth a few weeks ago. I need you back here. I can't do it. 1965. I hope I'm never in a life or death situation with gives. Ouch. Somebody called a burn unit. My feelings are burned. Oh my fuck, I knew it! Bitch. I knew it! Give me a dog any day. I freaking knew! I just had this weird feeling about a freaking kitty cat. Ay, ay, ay. Ah. Where were we? I was making fun of feelings. That's the true horror. Freaking cats. I feel like we should like hang with the cat. The cat's got like nine lives, right? That scared you? It scared me. I just had this weird sneaky feeling about it. Want a drink? Oh, I could use something stiff, Scarlet. Something grown up, you know? An adult beverage, perhaps? Kitty cat. I'm sure the cat was more scared of us than we were of it, but... It got me good. Hey! We're at the lighthouse. Game over. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Hit the buttons. No. No! Come on! Are you crazy? Mark knows what he's